this area of the um, of the tooth is called dentin you can see the dentin here as your dentin is the second hardest tissue dentin is the second hardest tissue in the body it consists of 70 percent inorganic substance which is calcium hydroxypartite 20 percent organic substance and 10 percent water it also consists fluoride and it also consists fluoride and carbonate and and the dentin is yellowish in color it's yellowish in color the structure of dentin consists of the structure of dentin consists of dentinal tubules peritubular dentin intertubular dentin peridentin and odontoblast process dentinal tubules these are dentinal tubules and dentinal tubules uh, they are found throughout the normal dentin and it characteristic of it They follows the gentle curve course in crown less so in root where they resemble shaped These tubules are perpendicular to DEJ and CEJ Near the pulpal surface the dentin of near the purple surface of dentin the number per square millimeter varies between 50,000 and 90,000 here also you can see the dentinal tubules dentinal tubules these are the dentinal tubules in upper part now we'll discuss about pretubular dentin here you can see the pretubular dentin the pretubular dentin the dentin that uh, that immediately surrounds the dentinal tubule is called pretubular dentin actually the dentin which immediately surrounds the dentinal tubules is called pretubular dentin and it's more highly mineralized then intertubular dentin it's highly mineralized then intertubular dentin here you can also see the intertubular dentin these are the intertubular dentin near the pretubular dentin intertubular dentin the main body of dentin is composed of intertubular dentin and it's highly mineralized the main body of the dentin is composed of intertubular dentin and it's highly mineralized here you can also see the intertubular dentin in the right side these are the intertubular dentin this is also intertubular dentin and this is the main body of dentin Here you can see the pre-dentin. Actually, this is the first form of dentin and not mineralized. It's located adjacent to the pulp tissue. In the upper part, you can see the pre-dentin, uh, pre and it is no, uh, non mineralized dentin present to on pulpal surface, comparable to osteoate or bone. now we'll discuss about uh, odontoblast process here you can see the odontoblast and in the lower part forming tooth pulp and the upper is odontoblast and this upper then pretentin pre enamel at the odontoblast actually odontoblast are the cytoplasmic extension of odontoblast they are the cytoplasmic extensions of odontoblast. They resides in peripheral pulp. 
there resides in peripheral pulp. These are the these are odontoblast process. Now we'll discuss about the functions of dentin. A dentin provides the bulk and general form of teeth. It determines the shape of crown, including the cusp, ridges, and the number of root. And dentin is necessary for formation of enamel matrix. It provides the bulk and general form of teeth. It determines the shape of crown including the cusps, ridges and the number of teeth root. Dentin is necessary for formation of enamel matrix. Thank you.